just a reminder, folks, in these first looks, uh, we do move slow, we do all the optionals, going to read the dialogue, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So if you want to stay for that, that's cool. I should have said that first, but I think you all know the deal with the first looks. I think you've all been a part of them before. Gwen Torian. Oh, hello. You're an adventurer, right? I have need of one to take care of a small issue with a property I recently purchased. So I bought a haunted house. But that's not the problem. Actually, the undead and I have become fa fast friends. However, since I purchased the house, the undead have become increasingly hostile. And I'm worried about them. Could you come to the property and see if you can figure out what's going on? In addition, if you have the time, I'd love to have you complete some renovations the undead and I agree upon. Kill two birds with one soul, if you will. Sure, I can help. What kind of renovations are we ta are talking here? Well, the undead and I agree to learning some tearing some walls down to create more of an open concept space. While the undead can phase through walls, it takes a lot of energy. So we all agree it would be better for all of us if the space was more open. You don't need to d knock down every wall we want torn down, but I'll happily compensate you for your efforts. Anyway, if you're up for the job, I'll meet you at the property. It's in the Upper Nymph's Court. It's, well, you'll know it when you see it. You want us to smash things? Consider it done. All right, so I also do want us to stay together. Let's try our, ooh, CR 36. Let's try our 10, see what happens. <laughs> it's not your first time. You lurk a lot. Well, uh, it says first time chatter. Uh, so maybe it's the first time you've spoken up in chat because I'm getting a box that says first time chatter, but I'm happy that you're chatting. And again, welcome. That's cool. It's I always love Sometimes we get people here that will lurk for months. Some, I've had people here that will lurk for a year before they ever say anything on the channel. So it's nice to hear from you. And that, you know, I always want everybody to know that everybody's welcome to be part of the community, part of the conversation. And I'm always happy to answer viewer questions. I don't want anybody sitting there you know, feeling too shy to say hi or too shy to ask questions. Because we love answering viewer questions. Ah, there you are. Thanks for your coming. The problem I'm facing with my house is, um, rather unusual. You see, this house is un- is inhabited by undead, and I knew this when I bought it. I spoke to the resident specters at length when I first decided to move here. Turns out they need perfect- they were perfectly fine with us living in the same house together. In fact, they even asked to have some of the walls torn down to open up the space. So the undead aren't the problem, or they weren't originally. That's progressive, I suppose. But just recently, the undead have gotten restless, violent even. Now I can't even enter the house without getting attacked. This is where you come in. Could you go in and find out what's causing the undead so much distress? Also... You look like you're good at smashing things. While you're in there, would you mind tearing down the walls on the main floor? You don't have to destroy all of them, but any help saves me the trouble of hiring a home renovation group to do the same thing. Kill two birds with one stone, right? And of course, I'll make sure to compensate you for both tasks. Hmm, definitely strange. I'll gladly investigate for you. We gotta turn on the DM volume. There's a real estate agent here. Let's see, DM narration. Boom. I have that turned off normally. Monkira, good evening and welcome. Sithkius, good evening and welcome. Well, Sithkius, I know I've seen you chime in before, maybe not too often, but I've definitely seen your name many a times. Slughead, good evening and welcome. Stepping in. You don't care about Miles? Oh, shoot. I'm sorry. I spaced. 
Can you turn on your Dion audio? Yeah, I turned it on. Do uh, you want to do Miles? Sure. It's no big shine, I think. The, this place is a dump anyway. Uh, are you the demolition crew hired to do the work in this home? I'm miles long. Sharn Premium Realty. Miles long. Listen, I've been trying to convince this owner to sell this house since she bought it. This is the last undeveloped land in the area, located so close to the Morgrave University. It's prime, prime real estate. I tried to tell her that it would be much more profitable to scrap the house and resell the land to a developer for an apartment building. I mean, the place is haunted, but she doesn't give a damn. She even says she's excited to live with the undead. How nuts is that? Yeah, fine. I'll uh, keep that in this mind. This man introduces himself as Miles Long, a real estate broker. He's been trying that's interesting. To that's an option that gives you XP. That's right in the beginning profit, of the quest. But she remains determined Thought we got rid of that with the giant hold farming. Miles had hoped the undead would scare her away, but was surprised to hear that she has befriended them instead. This house is indeed quite old. Do we this we got XP just for talking to him? Wow. The walls are practically falling down already. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. Angry spirits charge toward you. Maybe this job won't be as easy as you first thought. Fear. How you doing tonight, Slughead? Well, here's a wall that needs to be torn down. There's also a mysterious apparition on this chair. Ambush! Incoming! You Tough RPG. Well, thanks for the raid back. I raided you a few wow. hours ago. Good evening and welcome, Tough RPG. Tough RPG, party of 10. Your table is ready. Would you like to start with a cup? Of, no, with an appetizer or a glass of wine. We are serving dinner. I'll get you some menus in your server. We'll be with you shortly. Welcome, Tough RPG's viewers. Doing the first of the first looks. I, we, none of us have done these before. This is all new. This is update 67, just dropped today. I'm just getting in game today. No idea really what to expect. I didn't do these on Lamania. Todd Libby, good evening and welcome. Collectible. Live little maniac. Good evening and welcome. You do an awesome slughead. I'm glad to hear it. Mobs. Turn on that baby. I was just gonna say, did you turn them? That's awesome, dude. I've been turning this whole time. Are you like some kind of DJ or something? You tug on the door with all your might, but to no avail. Suddenly, you hear a giggling sound behind you. <laughs> you want to see the basement? You'll have to find me first. You realize just how good you are at demolition. Maybe that should be your plan for when you retire. Basement door locked. This attic door is not. Let's go to the attic. Hmm. 
mobs, uh, let's see. multiple reapers, doom, carnage, famine, two famines. But doesn't move to attack as the other inhabitants of the house have. Doom. A lot of things going on. Man. Lord, what you got me? That's just one of those moments where I'm like, I swear I hit staunch before I died. We'll have to check the replay. Maybe we'll step it down to R8 for the next ones. There's a shrine in here, by the way. But we might have stuff retreating to it. Um, three reapers are downstairs with me. I'm ready, but I'll wait for everyone. They're coming back. Well, everything except for the doom. Oh man, that horde will thing is murdering us. Still absorption. Oh, I, I was, I had a piece of gear on wrong. Gummy bear, thank you, you for the cheer. Money, I give you fun. I was gonna say, where are my cheer alerts? That one just sounded late, a little bit late. Mute Willie, good evening and welcome. That sounds like spell resistance. Oh yeah, gotcha. Make sure I have the right gear on. I haven't played this too. I haven't played DDO in a freaking week. Yeah, I don't even have the I don't have the right necklace on either. Good God! Well, we both everyone when we're all. Up. I had two pieces of gear on wrong. Can you run upstairs, Mav? Or are you too far away? Um, I'm downstairs below you guys. Doom Reaper's still here. Can you run up? Trying. Did you get that? Got it. You got it. I got it. I'm running back. Okay, cool. Smurf. Good evening and welcome. Oh, you want the OSU? Wow. Man, I, I gotta switch my hoodie real quick. I just need a second. Got rid of the New York, the new New York hoodie that I got at a service plaza in New York, and now we got the OSU hoodie going. I'm good to go. Mischievous apparition. I can't select this mischievous apparition. Can anybody do anything with it? I think we're supposed to find them in order, and because of shitty coding and laziness, they just allow us to see them all. Let's see what Gasper has to say. The friendly ghost. Oh, hello there. Are you the renovation crew Gwen hired to open the space around here? I heard you working. You're doing a wonderful job. I'm here to investigate why all the undead here are upset. Do you know? And why aren't you attacking me like everyone else? Ah, oh, yes, indeed. There's something with a dark aura down in the basement. 
It's stirring my flatmates into a frenzy. As for me, to be honest, I've always been a tad boring. Even now, I just sort of hang out here, so I guess I don't have much of a temper to flare up. Though I don't dare go down into the basement for fear I might become like my roommates. But you're strong and capable. I'm sure you can figure out what's going on. Thanks for the voice of confidence. The vote of confidence. I'll look down in the basement. Oh, I nearly forgot. Don't mind the mysterious apparition by the basement door. I'll let them know you have my permission to go down into the basement. Though they'll probably want to play a game with you before you go down. You'll have to forgive them. We don't get many visitors here. Let me know if you need anything else from me. Um, okay, bye. Gaspar explains that his undead housemates have become agitated because of something dark down in the basement. He's not keen on fighting, so he Break asks you to break. check it out. I guess we're going down. And we got a Doom Reaper Doom down there. Down Doom Reapers are my speciality. Step it down to R8. If we don't get more DPS in here, we could use one more heavy hitter. It's still locked. I think we gotta find the mischievous spirits in order. It cannot be fixed. Kill Sigil. Good, Good evening and welcome. What kind of voodoo voodoo is this? Welcome back, dude. Thank you for the welcome back. There's it's one good to of be these back. shining over here in the south. I think it's whichever one's shining. Aha. Uh -huh. mm, all right. I'll let you into the basement. The apparition concedes. But be careful down there. It's really scary. The rickety stairs creak as you make your way down into the basement. Your sense of dread grows with each I step. suspect that we the could have avoided the upstairs bat battle if we would have uh, figured out the mischievous the uh, spirit order. Shadows. That's okay, we want to um, do it all anyways for the first look. Then the shadows coalesce into a yeah, I'm just dreadful form. Sussing that out. I don't even know if that's true. I was going to try to do a first look this morning, but no one wanted to join and you were on. Yeah, we might want to drop it down to R6. I don't think we have enough DPS. No, we're going to drop it down to R8 for sure. Luna Rose Dragon, good evening and welcome. Luna Rose Dragon was there earlier for our little surprise. Unless this is the boss fight. Oh, by the way, Cozy Bean has been safely dropped off at the airport. 
If we got Conquest and Vandals, I suspect it is. Well, that explain why he's so thick. That uh, horde wilting thing he does is not fun either. No, that's intense. Well, I'm only taking about 1,800 this time versus the attic when I kept taking almost 3,000. I think that one was from a Famine Reaper. I didn't see one of these up there. Yeah, 1728 I got hit that time. Thing hits like the, the dickens. The so screeches right and <laughs> dissipates into nothingness. You spot an object in the dark corridor behind where it appeared. Strange tablet. It's the curse of Montiki. This strange stone tablet gives you an uneasy feeling. Take the strange stone tablet. You find a strange tablet behind where the radio is. Must be an Amazon tablet. The object Those gives off an ominous aura. Gaspar has lived in this house for a while. Perhaps he knows what it is. I see the eye upstairs. Yeah, Gaspar the friendly ghost. Turns out the agitating them is Chucky doll. Oh my god. You want this repeater, dude? It has a Reaper bonus on it. Me? Noise. Me? I'll give, take, give it to somebody who wants it. No, the artificer. Thanks, buddy. No problem, dude. Alright, we gotta go upstairs and talk to Gasper now. Hello again. Did you need something from me? Have you seen this weird tablet before? You've barely pulled the tablet. Oh, you barely told pulled the tablet out of your bag when you hear Gasper let out a gasp. Oh, I recognize that. There was a real estate broker, Miles. I think he said his name was. He was carrying something that looked like that tablet during the open house. And he went down into the basement. Yes, that thing is what what's making the others so distressed. It must be cursed. Pfft, I've met less shady devils. I'll talk to the guy. Gaspar doesn't recognize the strange tablet, though he does remember a real estate broker acting strangely before Gwen purchased the house. So, oh, what's this hole Perhaps here? You should see whether this real estate Shortcut. broker knows more. So now we go back out. And talk to Miles Long. Clever name. I can, I will. Um, all right, fine, you got me. I planted the tablet in the basement during the open house to stir up the undead. I had a buyer all lined up in almost that property and bag. Then this crazy ghost loving woman comes and turns everything and ruins everything. How do you manage to pull off the magic of that power? I hired a, I found, all right, fine, I'm a necromancer, you happy? The deal I was cutting with the development company of this property would have been perfect. I get the bodies buried underneath this house and I use, to use as I see fit, not to mention a hefty commission. This the is company not the dialogue the I'm seeing. Piece of undeveloped property in the most sought after neighborhood oh. in the city, everybody's happy. Then this lady ruins it. I just wanted her to see all her hard work come crashing down around her like I did. Just let the poor woman be. You could find bodies elsewhere. The shady real estate broker proved to be even shadier than expected. He's a necromancer.
This is one of those sneaky speak to this NPC, then speak to that NPC. Alright, Gwen Torian again. Hello again! Did you find what was causing the undead to be up so upset? Yep, turns out that real estate broker who's been hanging around is a necromancer. Oh dear, well thanks for looking into it. That broker seems to have disappeared. I'll make sure to get the fence fixed so he can't come back and cause us any more trouble. I collected some of the old things left in the house when I bought it. You can have them. You're thanking me for smashing stuff and giving me loot? This is the best day ever. Gwen isn't too surprised to hear of the real point. broker's villainy. She That's a quickie. You for your thorough investigation, as well as for your renovation work. I have another crossbow if somebody needs it. Let's go ahead and reroll. Ooh, legendary architect's cloak. Ooh, I got a reaper cloak. Reaper mythic. Deadly. Quality deadly. Fortification. Insightful fortification. That seems like it might be cool. I'm going to put it up for roll. What is this set bonus on this thing? Legendary Modeling Renegade. Four bypass, double strike, double shot. Just, uh, PRR. That's, oh, that's three piece and the fourth piece is melee range power and damage bonus to helpless. 